Good morning. Happy Friday. You've made it through another week of first grade and you are doing great. Today for phonics, Ms. Collins is going to start with our rhyming activity. Today I'm going to say three words, but only two of the words sound the same at the end, which means they rhyme. So after I say my three words, I want you to tell me which two words you heard that rhyme. Here we go. Pop, hip, hop. Pop, hop. Good. Set, sat, bet. Set, bet. Got, get, not. Got, not. Bug, bag, rug. Bug, rug. Hall, pill, fall. Hall and ball. Tub, rob, rub. Tub, rub. Try this one. Ban, tin, van. Ban, van. Cut, cat, butt. Cut, butt. Last one. Ham, him, jam. Ham, jam. Very good. All right, this time Ms. Collins is going to say a word and I want you to tell me the sound that you hear at the beginning of the word. And remember, if it's a vowel sound, I want you to also tell me if it's the short vowel sound or the long vowel sound where you hear the vowel say its name. The first word for today is the word April. A, that's the long sound that the A makes, good. Unit. U, that's the long sound that U makes. National, N. Telescope, T. And the last one, Eagle, E. That's the long sound of E. All right, get your choppers ready. Ms. Collins is going to say the beginning of the word, then I'm going to say the end of the word, and I want you to say the whole word. Here we go. Grand. Grand. Plant. Plant. Blend. Blend. Stomp. Stomp. Grunt. Grunt. Brand. Brand. Clamp. Clamp. Spent. Spent. Last one. Stand. Stand. Very good. Now I'm going to say a sentence and each word in my sentence will have the same ending sound. And I want you to tell me the sound you hear at the end of each one of my words. Here's my first sentence. Todd played hard. D is the sound you hear at the end of each word. Pam came home. Mmm. Pete ate yogurt. T. Liz has roses. Ooh, tricky. Z. Pop up, pup. P. Last one. Gus likes space. S. Very good. All right, let's keep going with our next activity. We're gonna get our choppers out again. This time, Ms. Collins is going to say the whole word and then you're going to help me chop it up between the beginning sound and the ending sound. Here we go. The word is ramp. Let's chop it. R amp. Good. Fond. Fond. Belt. 
b elt loft l oft sand s and keep going left l eft pond p ond hump h ump Felt, f elt. Last one. Silk, s ilk. Very good. All right, let's get our palms out. Miss Collins is going to give you the ending sound or the rhyme. We're going to add the onset or the beginning sound, put them together, and figure out which new word we make. Here we go. Esh, add. Mm, to the beginning, mesh. Ape, add t to the beginning, tape. Is, add h to the beginning, his. Eek, add w to the beginning, weak. Keep going. Us, add b to the beginning, Bus, ope, add s to the beginning, soap, last one, ond, add p to the beginning, pond, very good. All right, this time I'm going to give you the whole word. We're going to take away the beginning sound and we're going to figure out what's left. Here we go, the word is gum. Take away g. What's left? Um. The word is back. Take away b. What's left? Ack. The word is rhyme. Take away er. What's left? I'm. Cute. Take away k. What's left? Ute. Jam. Take away j. What's left? Jam, uh, am, sorry. The word is peak. Take away p. What's left? Eek. Fog. Take away f. What's left? Og. Head. Take away h. What's left? Ed. Note. Take away n. What's left? Oat. Last one. Like, take away ul. What's left? Ike. Very good. All right, this time we're going to get our two fists out, just like this. I'm going to give you a word. We're going to change the beginning sound, put it together, and make a new word. Here we go. The word is mast. Change m to k. Cast. Cast, change k to ul. Last, last, change ul to f. Fast, fast, change f to p. Past, last one. Past, change p to m. Mast, good, shake out your arms. We have another set. Let's start with the word feed. Change f to n. Need. Need. Change n to s. Seed. Seed. Change s to d. Deed. Deed. Change d to w. Weed. Last one. Weed. Change w to h. Heed. Very good. All right, time for our letters and our sounds. Here we go. Say them with me. T. T. V. V. D. D. E. E. Or E. 
O, A, or O. C, K, or S. K, K. X, K. Z, Z. U, A, uh, or U. S, S, or Z. G, G, or J. Q, Qu. F, F. P, P. I, I, or I. J, J. H, H. A, A, or A. N, N. W, W. Y, Y. M, M. B, B. L, O. R, R. All right. Our last activity for today is our nursery rhyme practice. I have a new nursery rhyme for today, everyone. The nursery rhyme that I have for today is called Hey Diddle Diddle. Give me a thumbs up if you've ever heard this nursery rhyme. Miss Collins used to look at nursery rhymes all the time when I was little. I remember every night before bed, my dad would come in and he would read me nursery rhymes and then I would memorize them and I would know them by heart. I hope you can do the same. All right, our nursery rhyme is called Hey Diddle Diddle. Remember, when Miss Collins says a line, you are going to copy me and say it after me. This is a repeating or an echoing activity. All right, I'm gonna say it first, then you're going to say it next. Here we go. The title is Hey Diddle Diddle. Hey Diddle Diddle. The cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such sport. And the dish ran away with the spoon. Good job. All right, very good everyone. Like I said, happy Friday. I hope you enjoy your school day today. You work hard, get all of your slides done for the slideshow and then you'll be ready to have a great weekend. See you soon, bye.